Now, the Wabash Valley's most watched newscast continues with Storm Team 10's Pamela Gardner. Good evening, everyone. It felt like winter has returned into the Wabash Valley. It doesn't feel like spring out there. Temperatures below average. We're going to continue to be below average over the next couple of days going into the weekend. Plus, we have a chance of a rain snow mix and accumulating snow in your near forecast and I'll have those details in just a couple minutes. High temperatures today, not too impressive. Our normal high should be 54 degrees. Mattoon only hit 39, Effingham at 39, Flora hit 40 degrees, Vincennes Robinson at 41, had again lots of cloud cover and from those clouds a little bit of snow spitting out. On the I Care Express Tower Cam, it's another overcast end to the day and our temperature right now in Terre Haute hitting our high of 40 degrees, winds just a light breeze up to three miles per hour, mainly coming from the north northeast. And everyone is in the 30s or the 40s at this hour. 41 degrees in Linton and in Robinson, Mattoon at 39, Bloomington the warmest at 43 degrees. The clouds still in place, a little bit of a wind speed and we add that to our temperature. That's how we get our wind chill temperature and it feels like the mid 30s in some spots. Mattoon feels like 35 degrees, not too bad of a wind chill but it does affect us a little bit and you will need that heavy coat if you're heading out the door later this evening as our temperatures will continue to decrease overnight into the 20s. As for a rain snow mix right now, nothing major showing up on Storm Team 10 Fury. We do have those very fine light flurries falling from the sky and that doesn't show up on the radar because it's not steady enough and it's not large enough to be picked up by our radar. On clouds and radar, more snow, some light freezing rain moved through early this morning. That whole mass is pushing off to our east. So what that means for us over the next 24 hours or so, we're going to see a brief break. Still going to deal with some cloud cover and light flurries, but no major systems until we move into tomorrow afternoon. And I'm going to show you what we can expect over the next couple of days. Timing everything out for you hour by hour on Futurecast going through this evening. We'll have a couple of breaks in the clouds here and there. Temperatures for Saturday morning in the 20s. Another cold start to the day and way below average. Throughout the afternoon, we start to see an increase in cloud cover. After about 2 o'clock, a couple of flurries will pop up in Illinois. And then, notice the blue starts to move in here and becomes steady and heavier throughout the evening hours into Sunday morning. So that's when our best chance of some accumulating snow is going to be up until Sunday at 7 o'clock, expecting about one to two inches of a very heavy and wet snow for Sunday. But then throughout the day, it's going to melt fairly quickly with our temperatures reaching above freezing. So tonight, low of 28 degrees, a very light wintry mix. Most of us seeing just cloudy skies. Tomorrow, a high of 40 degrees. Rain snow mix continues then, transitions to all snow, one to two inches, mainly to the south, but then pockets of some half an inch or so north of I-70. For your seven day forecast, we keep it cold. 38 degrees for Sunday, and some of that snow will melt. Monday, 44 degrees, and a slow increase in our temperatures to the 50s by next week.